Well, the Association of Public and Land Grant Universities has named Dr. Jason Dekoff with the Tennessee State University as a winner of its 2017 Innovative Teaching Award. Dr. Dekoff now joins us here in studio for, the further, for a further look at this accomplishment, and thanks for joining us once again. Thank you for having me. So, first of all, congratulations. Uh, tell us a little bit about what this means. So basically, I uh, worked with another professor at Ohio State University, Professor Nicole Kraft, and we developed a project to help improve uh, agricultural literacy. And they liked the project well enough that they, they provided this award. Why did you focus on ag literacy? Well, ag literacy, of course, is really important. Um, we want to be able to have people understand where their food comes from. We want them to understand how important agriculture is and how we need to continue to produce food in, in our country. And so uh, basically, we looked at two specific components. We looked at uh, communication, which is really important for agricultural literacy, and education, which, which is also important. So how is this project going to be set up to focus on ag literacy and get your accomplishments done? So we're both professors and we both have classes, and so what we're going to do is we're going to blend two of our classes together using certain assignments that are similar, and also I will provide a lecture to her students who are journalism students, and she'll provide a lecture to my students who are agricultural students. So. Um, the idea is that the, the students will learn from one another mm -hmm. and they'll learn from the professors that are involved so that the students that are in agriculture will increase their communication skills and the students that are involved in journalism will increase their awareness of agriculture overall. And you said she's a professor where? At Ohio State University. So we've got cross-university path going here. That's right. We Very always like to collaborate with our, with our fellow universities. So how do we know if it's successful? What do, do we have a measuring stick? Yes, we're going to be uh, doing multiple surveys of the students after different activities and after the program itself. And that's going to give us some hard numbers that we can really be able to determine which activities are the best and how successful the overall program was. Do you have an example of maybe an activity that you hope to employ? Sure, we've got an activity where uh, the students are, the agriculture students mm -hmm. are going to be interviewed by the journalism <laughs> students and so that way the agricultural students will you know, be able to communicate their information, their research that they're doing and the journalism students will be able to write something you know, for the popular press related to that agricultural research. The interviewees always love that. Yeah. <laughs> that's going to be interesting without right. a doubt. Well, what do you maybe hope to achieve? Achieve uh, in the future with this project once it's this wraps up. Sure. Once we're once we're done with this project and we've got a lot of good data, we hope to expand the project by uh, applying for a larger grant, mm -hmm. and that will allow us to expand this out to other universities that have similar programs where we can blend these kinds of courses together and increase agricultural literacy even more. Very interesting. Do you have maybe any kind of an online resource folks might be able to follow along with? Uh, right now, we don't have uh, an online resource set up, but they're more than willing to, to look at my website, which is at uh, www.tnstate.edu. All right. Well, thank you very much for joining us, and again, congratulations. Okay. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. Again, talking with Dr. Jason Dekoff, joining us here in studio with Tennessee State University. We certainly appreciate his time. Stay with us. More to come here in the next half hour right here on RFD-TV.